Hello and welcome to Drybox. My name is David and in today's video I will be unboxing and demonstrating the new T8S Plus V2. We start with the unboxing by taking the lid off. Inside we have the Droid Box, UK power adapter will include the correct adapter if you're from overseas. There's a HDMI cable and a remote control. And last but not least, there's a full English user guide. Onto the device itself. We've got the silver trim, the power button, SD card slot, three USB ports, and on the back you've got the power adapter, Ethernet, HDMI and optical output. So what we'll do next is show you a brief demonstration of the V2 up and running. Here is the Droidbox home screen. So from here you can access uh, shortcuts to commonly used apps such as Droidbox Media Center which is based on Kodi. You've got Droidbox Share which allows you to share uh, content from your mobile phone to your Droidbox such as uh, videos and images and music. You've got the Google Play Store the settings screen, the Brillec which we'll cover a little bit further in. So on the app screen we'll give you a brief overview of all the apps that are installed. So you've got AirPlay for sharing content from iOS based devices. You've got Web Browser, DBMC which we just covered and Droidbox Control Center. You've got Droidbox Market which gives you access to um, hundreds of and picked apps that uh, we've tested and added to it. We've got Droidbox Share and IP Vanish, which is a VPN provider. It's uh, very good if you want to access content from overseas. You've also got Kodi, which is the latest version 17. So this features the new um, user interface, as you can see on there. Media centers and uh, music players. You've got Netflix and OTA updates, which what this allows you to do is to easily update your firmware for the droid box and wrapping up we've got Emota which allows you to stream and play games from your PC onto your droid box and we've also got Skype and uh, YouTube apps. The T8S Plus V2 runs on Android 6 which is the latest version of the operating system so um, you've got a bit of future proofing with apps such as Kodi which uh, currently requires Android 5 and above and we've also got LibreLec which you can access through this shortcut. LibreLec is a dedicated version of Kodi. It does currently run Kodi 16 but we will be updating it to Kodi 17 shortly. Uh, to get back to Android you can press the power button and then switch to Android. You can find out more information about the T8S Plus V2 by clicking the link in the description below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to hit like and subscribe.